Hello everyone. Uh, uh, this project is part of the project of the uh, autonomous uh, vehicle system, uh, which in collaboration with the MIT Lincoln Lab. Our part here is the communication system of the robotic system, uh, which including the aerial unit, which is the UAV, and also the ground the ground unit. And our part uh, is designed based on the A2Q11P protocol because this protocol makes the communication more robust. And our project is basically divided into two parts. Uh, first, for the software part, we are uh, implementing the whole communication system on the green radio. And on the hardware side, we're implementing, building the tasks uh, on the Android and the USRP board. So for simulation part, we use a software-defined platform which allows us to simulate multiple node communications through IEEE 802.11p protocol. We choose the node radio as signal processing and simulation platform, and then we choose an open source module which will help us to uh, implement the math layer according to IEEE standards. Here, we keep the physical layer of open source code and we developed CSMACA, a block to implement our Mac layer according to IEEE standards. So, as you can see now, we can do a multiple to one communication simulation. This is one TX and this is the second TX and this is RX here. We also developed a log block which can allow you to log out all the timing and frame information and you can do system delay analysis and frame event analysis. You can also send messages according to different periods. Let me talk something about the experimental testing. This is a USRP so we use uh, to exchange information. And we run the radio on this Android board and uh, work with USRP to uh, form a node and uh, complete our test. Here is a simple example on our platform. Uh, this two USRPs work as transmitter, and this one is a receiver. Uh, you can see all of the data and the trans uh, parameters will display here. Uh, this is a constellation graph and uh, some adjustable par parameters. Uh, in this side, we transmit a message, hello, Buckeye, and in this side, we receive that message. So right now, we have all the tools for the task the performance of the communication system. So the next project, uh, next step of the, of the project could be to use some of the, uh, the parameters in this protocol to make the communication more robust. Thank you.